Hi there, YouTube. This is my uh, second Lego Tips movie. For uh, those of you that want your minifigure to have a trench coat, you can color the trench coat. And if you don't want to buy it from a mass production company, you can make it yourself. You need a sheet of paper. I've already been using this one a little bit. And if you want to make it black or whatever, permanent marker, if you want to draw it. Um, or any kind of marker like that. So, basically, you want to make a rectangle. Maybe a little bit bigger than this. I mean, it's about an inch across, inch and a half tall. Uh, let's see. What, Dad? Okay, hold on. Sorry. Um, and then you want to fold it so the two flaps meet in the middle. Or the two sides meet in the middle. I'm trying to make it as even as possible. Fold that. So it should look something like this now. So, then you take your scissors, and depending on how big you want the collar to be cut up or down to make the armholes, I usually don't make my collars too big, so I cut them decently close to the top. So it should look something like that now. So when you open the coat, it has the armholes. So take your minifigure that you want to have the trench coat, pull the arms back like that, and uh I could do a piece of tape. Them. I know and put them through the armholes, like so. You might need to make the armholes a little bigger than I made them so you can actually fit the arms through them. Okay. <sighs> oh, you know, I almost forgot. Uh, you want to fold the collar. So, basically you want to take what's going to be your collar Fold it down like that. And put it onto your minifigure. So, yeah, I made these armholes too small. Okay. You start it on here. Do you mind? I'm in the middle of filming. Where's your camera? Right there. Anyway, um, so, yeah, you want to make the armholes a little bigger than I made them. As you can see, the trench coat's a bit long, so you just want to sort of cut it down. Um, see, that's basically how you make a trench coat. Mine isn't working too well because I made the armholes too small. But, I have another one right over here. So you want to make the armholes about that big. I mean, that might be a bit too big. And if you color your trench coat, you might want to make the color same, the arm color, same as the trench coat. So you put the trench coat on, and now you've got your trench coat minifigure. You can make it different colors. Brown, black, gray, whatever. Just as long as you have minifigure arms that are the same color. I haven't finished this guy yet, but basically he's got a black trench coat. And um I still need to put the black arms on him. So that is all for today, YouTube. More videos coming soon. 
Mr. Zero Zero signing out.